Hello everybody, this is Funtime Claw and welcome to Dan the Man. And yes, finally we're gonna play this game on mobile. So basically it's kind of a cool game that is still fun to play for probably me and myself. So we're gonna start with the prologue and then let them begin the level. Yes. Seven. Yeah, this might contain lots and lots of lag. Oh, believe me. Once you once you see lag, you're gonna be crazy about it. So crazy. Okay, okay so if, if these town people versus these other people, the other people wants to. Uh, Attack the king, the king of the towers to take over. And right now, this is it's showing us the basic attacks. So, oh, yeah, I mean, I mean, you can't go, I mean, you can't jump in water because you're jumping in the water. You like lose HP, which basically shows you up top, on top left corner. These are the save points. These, they also save. Okay. And there's no lag still. So probably, probably gonna be, probably gonna probably be safe with lag. Okay, so going. And then it's probably gonna load, load the volume. Yeah. So yeah, keep breaking, keep, keep breaking these bases. Yeah, some of these bases, some of these bases give you coins, some of them probably give you like food. And these are the people that we see in the beginning of the game. So, if you guys saw my uh, second announcement, you know that I'm making a Crash Bandicoot. You should surely let's play on my on the channel first. I hope you guys like this way enjoy it because it's coming soon. And I'm probably thinking of when am I gonna do it. Also about Argamai, uh the Shadow Edition and uh Dead Souls. I'm still thinking about about those three games. But just right now I'm thinking about making that Crash Bandicoot Saint Trilogy video for you guys. And yeah, we fit we completed the first prologue we did great I'm, I'm proud okay. so basically you have to try you have to find everything in the game oh yeah number four go to prologue if you go tap that that says four around here it shows you the things that you level up and then on the top right corner is my coin so I can use my coins to like upgrade my characters like that so now, if I keep like upgrading my character, I my character can get stronger and stronger, which is basically actually cool. Use the force or guns, so that's the call. Now, every level has a weird, weird uh, name for it. So yeah, we got chickens. We can, we, can, we can use to uh, so instead of like punching them, we can shoot them in long range. We can we can throw weapons or shoot them with guns with long range like that. And I can do that. Yeah, and you see you see new characters in the game. Like we saw the. So, we got the riot guy with the shotgun. So, we got another save point. So, if you get two weapons, you, what it says, what it shows you the shuriken, you can press the, you can press this to switch your weapon, switch your stuff. So, you know, you know I, I, I'm using my, uh, my gun, my weapon, I got my shurikens. Right now, I have 20 of them. So, 
so more fun about this game is like try collect some coins so you level up your character. Because because every time we level up your character, there's gonna be you, you need to get like more and more points to level up, level them up. But yeah, and then you and then you go to stores, which basically you can just like, buy weapons or or health or or weapons might be dropped. It also tells you the, how much damage it takes, like right now, the, the, the rocket launcher takes like 75. Like, as you know, as you know how, much, how much damage it, the, the weapons or your melee attack takes, it, you can probably get better and be better, better, better to defeat more. And then, yeah. Also, some of these bosses that you fight is like gets harder and harder. So yep, it's old, I guess. So right now, prologue two is completed. It only took 25 damage, which is good. The 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 more the more best thing to do is like not to get damage. Also. Also, every time when you like beat a level, you get you get you unlock a chest that you can get co like gold coins. Like if I like beat a level and I get a chest, you get you might get 25 250 coins or like more. So now we met a new enemy, which has a shield. So so my strategy right here is so like, Jump up and just, and just kick them, kick him right in the head. So yeah, that's my plan. Every time I see a, I see a shield guy. Also, I heard that Doctor Mario World is out today. So I'm, so I'm basically excited to try the game. Or maybe show you guys, show you guys me playing a, pu a puzzle game. Cause I, cause I played, I played the old uh, Dr. Mario game. It was fun. And I, get, and then uh, like one time, Game of Shock and I played Super Mario Bros. 3 together. But, and we got and there's a statue, which, which, which if you break the statue. You get an ad, and then, it get, and then uh, the the TV gives you something like random, like a random stuff. We have, to, we have to watch that ad. So right now, my favorite characters in this game is the is those two on on the left side where the robot was. Yeah. So this is gonna be our first boss. So basically, every every three levels you beat, there's gonna be a boss battle. So yeah. Some of these, some of these. I mean, some of these bosses might be like robots, and some of these it might be like humans. But I don't know. I'm not. It's gonna be humans also. I'm probably thinking that there's all, every boss is gonna be like robots, and we beat the first boss in in the prologue. So we did it. We beat the prologue. And these guys are not happy. So they're not happy about it, and they just and they told everyone else that that we just that we defeated it. Oh so, yes, yeah, that's the end of it, and now we go to the main story. So yeah. Thank you guys for watching this video. I don't want a t-shirt. 
And anyways, thank you for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Subscribe to me, Gaming Shocks, and yeah. And I'll see you guys in the next Dana Man video, which is probably not that long. But I'll see you guys. Bye bye.